Welcome, this is Brittany from the Colorado Classroom, and I'm here to teach you how to play Skunk, a probability game great for the math classroom. Skunk requires four items for play. Each student and the teacher needs a recording sheet and pencil. The teacher also needs two six-sided dice. Each letter in the word skunk is a round. During the round, the teacher rolls the dice and records the total on the recording sheet. This continues every time the dice are rolled. The student should be standing at their desk recording the dice rolls as they happen. These are the student's points. When a student feels like they have enough points and no longer wishes to play the odds, they may sit down, draw a line, and add up their points for that round. Jenny and Evan both sat down with 17 points. Lisa sat down with 24 points. Tim and Karen are continuing to play. What Tim and Karen are hoping to avoid are a roll with a one in it, or even worse, the dreaded snake eyes. Anyone left standing when a one is rolled in any combination automatically loses all their points for that round and receives a zero instead. This then ends the round. If snake eyes are rolled instead, anyone standing not only receives a zero for that round, but receives a zero and is automatically out for the next round as well. Continue to play rounds two through five following these same rules. While in theory a round could go on forever, most will take between one and twenty rolls. When all five rounds have been played, scores are added up and the highest score wins. If you're short on time, try playing duck, pig, or ox. I hope you've enjoyed learning how to play skunk. Please check out another Tools for Teaching Teens video on our website.